Crisis managers from several different state agencies were in the emergency operations center Wednesday. In the back of the room, a constant loop could be seen of a computer model showing how the coming Arctic blast is expected to push through Texas. Governor Greg Abbott was also in the center in a nearby briefing room getting updated on how the state is preparing. Snow and ice, like what happened in 2021, is not expected. And while this new event will only bring bitter cold, Governor Abbott indicated he understands why people are worried, despite assurances that the state is prepared. Trust has to be earned back over a period of time. And I think that we will show that we can earn that trust. Scattered localized power outages are possible during this weather event. As for the statewide power grid, the chairman of the Public Utility Commission said this. The grid is ready and reliable. We expect to have sufficient generation to meet demand throughout this entire winter weather event. Pipes froze and broke during the extreme weather event in 2021. Residents were told there's still time to winterize their homes, apartments, and even vehicles. But listen, any flat tire, any bad battery problems and stuck out in this dangerous <clears throat> cold can be life threatening. There's also concern that the cold will increase the risk for fires sparked by improper use of space heaters and cases of carbon monoxide poisoning from wood burning stoves and generators that do not have adequate ventilation.